Call me Master Zangas, I'm a flippy bass. Ladies and gentlemen, bro, you see the stupid title, JJK Jumping is our, our Hall of Fame worthy of, bro, the title, bro, you see the stupid title, looking into it. Now. Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, I'd like to welcome you to the JJK Jumping Hall of Fame. And the show where, let's be honest. Wait, fifth anniversary? What, what's out of, what, am I late? What the hell? Ones are rarely ran. It's hard to pick what truly deserves a Hall of Fame spot. But tonight, we welcome our first inductee into the Hall of Fame. Oh, Gojo reverse jumping the disaster curse spirits. And that's right. We actually have Gojo in the building here to answer some of your questions. Back over to you, Zah. Thanks, Zah. Um, I'm here with Gojo Satoru, um, also known as the Honored One. Um, is there a reason you call yourself the Honored One? Hey, man. Why you disrespect me like that, man? <laughs> you know why they call me the animal, man. Man, he ain't nah, nigga. Cause I'm the strongest nigga that ever lived, man. It's that simple. <laughs> uh, why the hell are you talking like that? Hey, like, bro, talk normally, man. Is that, bro? That, hold on, that's kind of pause. Cause he's talking like that, trying to impress. Okay, the females are watching the the show. I hope. But he's talking to another man, talking like that. Sounds weird, bro. Why is you trying? Is he trying to flirt with him? Ain't not talking. I talk, man. It's simple as that. Man. It's that light skin shit. This that I don't want shit. You don't know nothing about that because you ain't on it once. You ain't anyone. <laughs> um. Uh, all right then. Um. You say you're the strongest man to ever live. Does that include Prime Sukuna? Why you keep asking me these bullshit ass questions, man? I fought that nigga once, man. You saw it happen. I literally sat on that nigga, man. <laughs> That nigga's my bitch, man. He's my female dog, man. Roof, roof, man. Bro, I cannot hear what the head is goofball to say, bro. Talk normally, man. <laughs> that nigga can't touch me. That nigga can't hold me, man. Are you sure about that? Because I don't know. There's a lot of people out there that would probably say it's split in half yeah. if, if he gets my drift. <laughs> See, this is why I'm tired of y'all reporting niggas, man. Disrespecting my name, man. Because how you gonna come out here and you gonna say shit like that? You, know. you know that shit was plot. You know that shit was pop, man. You gonna come out here and say that shit to me, man. I don't know why you're acting like it was the plot. You yourself admitted it, but but anyway, oh. stop acting so cool, stop acting so tough. We were gonna pick Itadori and Toto against Hanami anyway to be the first inductee. Like, uh, I don't even know why they chose you this time. Oh, I got like disrespectful, though. Man, because you know who ended that jumping nigga? Me. I say you them niggas, man. I was the one who sent Hanami running, man. So look at you. Well, you know, you look, you look stupid. You, you know what? Yo, I'm about to just hit hollow purple on your little stupid ass. How about nah, you, bro, you pussy here for that. Because you get mad because a person is just talking. Some of the, some of the things are facts, but come on. Do it then, nigga. Or are you half the man you used to be? Hell no, just leave it alone. Who you talking to? You want to keep trying? I have, have to get back to you later, stupid ass. ass. Well, the funny. So the scene begins with Gojo coming face to face with the disaster curses. <laughs> you couldn't beat me once, so you spun the block with the homies. <laughs> you little, little lame man. You the lame nigga, man. You be using hacks. Nah, man. You ain't even finna get me tight, man, because today's the first time you lose. They decide to enclose Gojo in the subway. You'd think it'd be so that he can't escape, right? Mm. Incorrect. It's to prevent Gojo from using the full extent of his powers by getting civilians in the crossfire. And they out here getting straight to business. Jojo's ah. catching body after body. How do we out Uh, I don't... Bro, this, uh, that's why I be saying... Hold on. Not I be saying. I don't be saying that. Why did he burn those people? What was the use for that? I don't really get it. I guess sometimes it's like unnecessary murder, man. You're running through people. And Togo tries to blood snipe Gojo, who looks perplexed that he even tried. <laughs> um, that's all? But Jogo and Hanami hop out of nowhere with this My Hero Academia power friendship ass punch. And Goku just visibly laughs at them like, <laughs> he ain't even <laughs> taking them seriously. This shit is crazy. Well, I mean, he wasn't until they used domain amplification to nearly penetrate his infinity. They actually caught Gojo off guard. Oh, yeah. Forced him the instant transmission out of there. Hmm, I got it. This is crazy. Yeah, I know. We caught your ass lacking, didn't we, nigga? <laughs> yeah. Nah, gang. You thinking you could beat me? It's nah, 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 nah. You talking like that? Then why did you move then? Why did you move then, man? Crazy. Okay. Did Gojo need to take the blindfold off like that, though? Nigga truly is light skin as hell. 
Y'all already know he said some sin. Sin said he was a baby. But Gojo looks just as pissy as he does light skin. It's normally let the jumpers commence. <laughs> but this time, let the reverse jumpings begin. Huh. Let's see. Hey, you horn nigga. I've seen your ass three times. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that name's so stupid. I don't know, bro. What are you whore, nigga? It's like he's saying so many things, but like he's... Oh, and bro. you still got no shirt on? <laughs> you do know I'm the only nigga allowed to thirst trap in this show, right? <laughs> right? The last nigga thought that shit was sweet. I put a donut in him. <laughs> You're next. Come on. I think that's... that's a, I think they say that's a female. I don't know. Let's dance. Gojo grabs Jogo's hand and throws him over his back. Rushes him to the floor and puts him in an arm bar. Ha, <laughs> gang. Jogo looks distraught as hell. Gojo out here wringing his arm out like a... That are not a grown man putting his ass on your face? That's crazy. Wet towel with the widest smile on his face. He enjoying this shit a little too much. I'm not gonna lie. But just... Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Is he riding that man's leg? Wait, not leg, the arm. The strut as hell. Gojo out here wringing oh, his arm out like a wet towel with the widest smile on his face. He enjoying this shit a little too much. I'm not no. gonna lie. But just like that, he snaps off Jogo's arm and uses it to block Hana. Then Cobra Kai kicks him halfway across the station. Damn! Why is Gojo standing like this? <laughs> there are no cameras around. Who are you trying to impress? But with the brightest smile on his face, yeah. he launches towards Jogo and Hanami. Man, this shit was straight out of Jimmy Neutron <laughs> or something, bro. <laughs> the scream in the face were derpy as hell. Bro crashed onto that wall hard as hell. He's only attacking Jogo. Was he just capping for the net? This nigga must think I was sweet, man. He won't learn a date. But Hanami, I'm afraid. That's exactly what Gojo wanted. The moment she used her technique. Gojo pounced on his prey and then his, ripping the horn straight out of her head. Turned her in the. You see, you see her. Wait, hold on. Well, any any person can be called a nigga, so it's like it's the same as like, yo, bro, but you not, she's not actually a bro. It's like just the way you talk. I don't know, but I feel like he was he called up, but he was like calling this person a a man or like a I don't know. Bro. I'm just chatting right. Jack skeleton. This is Halloween face ass. God damn, that could have been me if I wasn't locked in. <laughs> I told Hanami to stick to the damn plan. Why did Giga have to make you so OP, man? You can't forget about Choso, though. Sending his piercing blood towards Gojo, failing to hit him once again. Though it was just a setup for Jogo and Hanami to try another domain breaking attack. But shit, man. They soon find out whether they were setting themselves up. Gojo starts walking down Hanami. Mm. and laughing as he uses his infinity mm. to crush her. Smiling in his face as you slowly murder him is absolute pandemonium. Nah, he needs to go to a psychiatric ward with that. Uh. It will turn into a pencil shade drawing. There's no way out of this one. You're done. done. Wow. Gojo pulled a freezer. <laughs> Pop goes the weasel. Head up. <laughs> <laughs> that was a stupid it's lie, bro. I'm, I'm dead. <laughs> he got cursed spirit splooge all over the place. Huh? That's some murder. It's all about Pop goes and Weasel. Work around here, man. T tell Toji I said hi. Weak ass niggas. But <laughs> anyway, your turn. It starts to hit Jogo that he doesn't have a chance. He starts taking off, and this shit goes from an attempted jumping to a horror movie scene real quick. Very reminiscent of the same I'm you scene from later in the season. Jogo tries dipping over the guardrails as Jogo tails him. But I gotta know why he felt the need to climb up like this. Ugh. Is this nigga serious? This nigga right here been floating the entire time, but now all of a sudden he wanna take his flex into new heights. Okay. He continues his pursuit for Jogo. Oh, freak out boy. He's using humans in a hit and run tactic, you know, kind of like some Tom and Jerry timing, you feel what I'm saying? Which show so providing backup, of course. That's when it really sets in for Gojo, that he won't be able to save everyone. So he vows to exercise them all instead. It's a good thing that ain't me, because I would have said domain expansion, it would have been over. You feel me? Wait, so no wonder, uh, I don't know, the, the, the organization he's working for, the school, they see, they got, he got to be executed? 
Why the hell? Bro, he could have just escaped and went to a place where, like, what the hell? Well, anyway, let's stay on track. Out of nowhere, Gojo hears sounds that sound like a train is coming. And, well, it has. Everyone's starting to think they're safe. Get out the way, man! I got a dookie move, my n damn! Uh, hey. I had to. I had to dookie. Holy mother of pearl! The train was filled with nothing but cursed spirits led by, of course. Oh, lord. Look at this goofball. Long Fierre! God, seeing his face just reminds me why I hate him so much. Oh, Man, bro. I hate this patch face, no lip, one tooth, ashy, saucer, corny ass nigga. What do you say fuck me for? But man, let me relax. He, he out here getting me tight, man. Paul. Bro, you got him, bro. Come on, man. I was out here laughing and having a good time. Then this goofball had to appear. Just the five of why you hate that nigga too. I hate that nigga too, man. Mahito is zesty as hell. Don't think I forgot about you trying to kiss Itadori, man. Hey, you see, come on, man. He tries to meet his ass, but Mahito wheezes and dives back, thinking he'd die with Playboy Cardi or something. <laughs> and at this point, all hell breaks loose. I Blood transfiguration. So much patience. Mahito and Shoso just start catching body after body, turning this to a nightmarish massacre. Before Gojo can even process things, he gets attacked from above by Jogo, getting his arm boot ganged again. But he ain't yelling like Curse the Cowley Dog this time. <laughs> He's smirking real devious like, knowing that this time, they've surely got Gojo on the ropes. With him facing a moral dilemma. <laughs> Finally, we got him where we want. I'm not gonna lie, that was a tough ass pick right there. That, that, that little ass scene. Hold on, bro. Real devious like, knowing that this time, they've. Like this, this, this. Hold on, I'm showing my goofy self. This is a tough ass scene. I'm not going to lie, bro. This is tough. Surely got Gojo on the ropes. With him facing a moral dilemma. <laughs> Finally, we got him where we want. <sighs> He's known for being a D1 crash out, unlike Itadori lame ass. But with all these people getting smoked, he knows he can't risk it. <laughs> He's morally all right with deaths caused by cursed spirits. Hey, man, just Not a problem, bro. Caused by Gojo Satsu. Use the problem. He's too righteous to use infinite light skills. We've did it. We've gotten the best of the honor domain expansion. <laughs> Infinite light skin. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is this, this nigga serious? serious? <laughs> Is he really about to use his domain expansion? Oh yeah. This shit getting hot real quick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but before that, a quick word from our sponsor, Anime Express. Sexy Gojo. Oh hell no. Hey, get your money, black man. Hold on. What's going on? Wait, wait, wait. That's a weird, that's a weird necklace. I don't know whoever be buying these type of things. This is demonic, me. Hey, man. Hell. They got y'all right, too. Hell you can nah. find all this and more yeah, at yeah, Anime who, Express. That's the Hooters are tough, whatever you buy. Hell no, nah, man. Them necklaces, weird. You eat, it's a win win. Now go to Anime Express. That store and use code za 10 for 10% off at checkout. Hey, get your money back, man. Oh my god. Gojo really did it. He activated his domain, leaving the curses in shock. They all thinking that it was a 99% chance <laughs> it's cow. Hey, Gojo was a D1 crash up for a reason. He'll always fuck around and find out. But this time, he uses the domain in a bit of a different way than when he ripped Jogo's head off. Instead, this time was a gamble of a domain of 0.2 seconds. That's right. Two tenths of a second. His domain lasted shorter than a blink. Shorter than some dudes in the bedroom. Shorter than Roddy Rich's career. <laughs> For pure instinct, he concluded that this was how long the non sorcerers could withstand in his domain before becoming vegetables. This was all decided in the brief few seconds of chaos when it looked like all hope was lost. Mm. But when you're him, you make the hardest decisions instantaneously. Ugh, that was tough. So no, 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 no. Not only were the survivors able to live a normal life after two months, but Gojo was able to exercise every single transfigured human in that tenth of a second. I mean, is it a shocker that he's getting the inaugural award? <laughs> he survived in a thousand V1 uh, jumping. With hey, he, he is a goofball, but that interview just proved to us he's a goofball, but hey, he earned his award, man. Not a single scratch on him. No wonder bro was huffing and puffing at the beginning of the episode. <laughs> <laughs> he was putting that work. Man got cursed spirit goop all over the place. <laughs> got him looking derpy as hell deceased. <laughs> but man, just as Gojo's catching his breath, he notices the prism realm. And unfortunately, 
seeing his best friend Ghetto's body once again causes him to panic. And he gets caught lacking. And wait, who is, bro, can someone please explain who is Ghetto? Wait, 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 wait. At the, like the first episodes, he was like, or like he, hold on, bro. I guess you're just that's stupid and stuff, man. Like he betrayed him or something. Hey, bro, don't get mad at me for not knowing. Uh, the only way I watch you, uh, uh, anime is like through these recaps. So I can't watch anime because I do YouTube every day. For the new people, gotta explain this every time for me. This, of course, led to the ceiling of the strongest sorcerer of all time. As he was too like, did he turn on him like he was actually evil? His like he was like trying to infiltrate, infiltrate whatever. Too damn strong for the plot to move forward. <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen, that's got to be one of the greatest reverse jumpings. In all right, hey man. I'm still on this video, bro. Another day living in Africa, bro. The electricity is finna go. It's like uh, 9 a.m. So I'm gone, bro. So feel me? Sub to the channel. I'm still on this video. Goofball, you. Yeah. Call me Mask Zang, cause I'm a flippy bass.